Hey, good afternoon. What are you guys up to today? If you are in California, I am absolutely positive you have been following Facebook most likely or the news about all the tragedy that's been going on with fires. I am, uh, by the way, I'm Sue Brooke coming from Sebastopol, California, and I'm sitting here looking outside and I can see the sun and it's probably not going to show up very well, but I'm, we're very far from the fires, like a couple of hours, I think someone said, but the smoke and the air quality is really horrible here. And I don't know if I, I can just try turning it around and showing you what the sun looks like. It's, it's actually, yeah, this is probably going to show you, but it's just as bright pinkish red as you could possibly get. And it's very, very bizarre. So, um, what are you grateful for today? I mean, it's days like this, you know, when things like this happen, that sometimes we forget to be super grateful. Um, you know, I, I was online and I was watching some people had, have post, they posted uh, a video, like a live video of them driving through the fires, like the fires on both side of the, sides of the road. And it's very dark and you cannot even see that far in front of you. And this, this woman, she was praying and there was, it was just really scary. Like I, you could feel it. It was a live video and she, they were driving through the fires and the fires were on both sides and they'd go through a black thing of smoke, probably having no clue what was on the other side of this black smoke. And then there's, there's all kinds of ashes and, 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 and fire going across the road and they're having to drive right through it. And then there's another big cloud of smoke and, and, you know, you can just feel their, their, how, how scared they were to go through that. And they didn't know what was coming up next. And, you know, it's kind of like, it really started making me think, I thought a lot about this afternoon about, you know, that's, it's really a lot like life, right? We're going through, on this road of life and, and you, we can't really see that far ahead of us sometimes. And, and there's fires all over the place. You know, everybody's going through something. And anyway, they were going through, through, and it just made me think of that. And then pretty soon there was a big tuff of smoke and they couldn't really, a big, you know, cloud where they couldn't see and they went through it. And then it was blue sky. Like they had gotten through this, this, uh, horrible Armageddon of fire. And uh, anyway, I it just, I know we are, we're all probably feeling it today, especially if you are in California or you know people in California, but let's all try to see how grateful we can be today and find things to be grateful for. You know, it's, it's hilarious how many people, you know, they, they cry about certain things that they, they're going through. Like I just had someone send me an email that said, oh, times are really, really tough right now. All my money is going to a new house I'm building, you know, and it made me think, wow, there's people out there that wouldn't even, even think to have, be able to go build a house They're They don't even have a bed to sleep in, you know, or they're struggling every single day. So whatever you have, whatever you're doing right now, and wherever you are in your life, no matter what, Please be grateful for what you have. Be grateful for the friends around you. Be grateful for being able to be on a phone or your laptop right now watching this video. And I'd love to know what you are grateful for. Yes, um, yeah, Norman, I, you know, it is super sad. So let's throw out some kindness into the world. Let's be really super grateful and just bring really positive stuff into the world today. You know, get over the whole politics thing. Get over the things that don't really matter in life. What really matters is we're on this planet right now and we need to be grateful for that. And, uh, hi Kyla, how are you? So, um, you know, I, I, it just kind of brings back my story, you know, as I'm sure you guys all have your own stories of things that have happened in your life. You know, I, I was hit by a truck. I was hit by a truck in 2006 and I, I really should not be sitting here today. And I'm so incredibly grateful for the opportunity to still be here. So trust me, 
the worst of the worst could happen to you in five minutes from now. You don't even know what's happening. So please be grateful for what's going on. Put kindness and positivity in the world, please. We need that right now. Everybody in America especially needs that right now. And I'm just begging that whatever you're posting on Facebook, whatever you're, whoever you're talking to, whatever your thoughts are thinking, make sure they're positive and find something to be grateful for no matter what you are in. So um, hey there, uh, da, da, da. I got some people talking. Hi, Lily. Um, yes, <laughs> I'm grateful this year is so different and better than that last year. Right. And, uh, you know what? A lot of you, some of you who know me know that I've been going through a pretty crazy thing, um, that has happened to me over the last couple of years. And, you know, I just choose to be positive. I choose to put out positive things. So I hope that you'll do the same thing. Post a positive quote in the comments. Would you do that? Your favorite positive quote to make everybody feel awesome today. And, um, you know, just go out and have an amazing, wonderful day and put some kindness into the world. Okay. Hi again. This is Sue Brooke and I will talk to you soon. Have a great day. Bye.